Hey YouTube, we are back again with another video. This is of the Overnight Sensations I already showed you built. Uh, I already did a walkthrough. If you haven't seen that video, please go back and look at it. This will kind of, That'll give you an idea of what it looks like and what went into it. This right now is going to be a sound test. So we're going to play a bunch of music through it. I'm actually going to play two songs from two completely different genres. We're going to play Killing Time by... Kevin MacLeod, and we are also going to play Beethoven Symphony Number no. 5. That way you get an idea of exactly how these perform. Now before I play these, I just want to tell you that they are absolutely amazing. Every single person that I get to go in here, its eyes just light up when they hear these things. Um, you may not get the full effect because we are recording with uh, a, just a, a regular camera, but I wanted to make sure that you could at least hear them and see them in action, watch the woofers go. And once again, I, I just I just want to emphasize that uh, almost every single person that has listened to them has decided that they want to build one of these. So before you waste your money on spending it on a high-end system that you see in the store, uh, take a serious thought about whether or not you want to do some DIY work. Because if you do some DIY work, I mean, these things, like I said, they're unbelievable. Without further ado, let's listen to him. Here goes Killing Time. Thank you. 
Okay, guys, I hope you really enjoyed that. That is the end of the music section that we're listening to. Uh, I just want to make some quick comments on that. Uh, you may not be able to tell, but man, that thing is really, really loud and clear and clean. Um, if there's any distortion coming through to your speakers, it's because of the microphone. It's not because of those speakers. Those speakers sounded perfect all throughout. Um, and that's just one of the things that, that just absolutely amazes me is how loud they can get and yet still be crystal clear. Uh, but... Um, that's all the music that we're going to play today. If uh, you want me to play any other type of music, um, just let me know, and we'll see what kind of music we can get going. Um, something that's not, obviously, um, copyrighted, but if you want to hear, like, pop or jazz or something on there, I, I can throw something else on there. But those two, I thought, were completely different musical spectrums, which is why we want to try it. Once again, guys, um, the dynamics of that, especially in Beethoven Symphony, if you heard it got really, really soft and then got really, really loud, and yet it kept... An amazing tonal frequency across, oh, I'm sorry, tonal balance across all frequencies. Um, I do want to tell you real quick, there is no tone adjustments that I've done on this. This is just straight from Bluetooth 4 going straight to those speakers. So that is whatever the source material is giving out, that's what these speakers are going out. And that's what's so great about them is they recreate the sound so well. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. And as always, like the video and share it with your friends.